All right, so this would be a part three of uh, our experimentation with the 325. We now have gimbal pucks at every hard point. So we have two size twos and one size three because pucks take it down um, one, one um, notch. So if puck is three, it will accept size two weapon. And in this case, this is a size 4 puck or gimbal mount, and it will accept the size 3 weapon. Alright, so we got um, all gimbal, all energy. Let's see how this will work out. Same bounty, MRT, LRT bounty. Um, let's see. Uh, let's see how we do this time. Uh, let's see if this ship is a little better with gimbals. Now, the only thing would be left to try is the ballistics. But let's see how this goes. Alrighty. Okay, let's go get this bounty out of the way and test this out. We did repair our ship. Did it restock it? Nope, still did not restock the missiles. Excellent. Can we do that now, you think? Oh, at least it recognizes that the restock is needed. Let's see if that... Nope, that's not gonna restock it. Awesome. Oh, well. Looks like we're not doing the missiles thing. Get out of the Atmo here. Still a nice looking ship, but I always thought that the front gun mount could have used a little bit of work. Just feels out of place because uh, Origin ships are kind of flowing, all sleek lines, and the weapon up front kind of seemed like an afterthought. Well, let's let's give it another shot here. Nah, which planet are we on here? Oh yeah, okay, before we pass out here. Now, oh, let's get out of here. Go the, seems to be always some planets that's directly opposite where we need to go. So we will need to find another orbital marker to go to. There we go. Let's try this out now. Um, probably should have found a better capacitor. Uh, well, let's see how this this will perform. There we go. Always oh, on Vala, so I always have to jump around. But at least it's not far. And we're gonna maintain the power setting split equally between thruster shields and energy, just like in last fights to kind of compare the effectiveness. Because I can put bigger guns on here, or like in the case of the ballistics, but if you don't hit your shots, you know, we're not doing any DPS, even though potentially you could be doing more DPS. Now, let's see here. But of course, it's nowhere near I need to travel, so let's travel here and then just hoof it. I don't, I don't know why all of a sudden all the bounties are in the middle of nowhere where you can't quantum jump to them. Used to be they were all on, you know, points of interest, and now they're literally in the middle of nowhere. I just, I don't know, just seems like it started happening more and more lately.
So see now we gotta hoof it a good ways because we just can't fast just can't quantum there. Nope, nothing. Nothing that is close. At least this is Atma. Yeah, this is pretty, ain't it? That's cool. That's a beautiful looking ship. I'm not gonna dispute that fact. Okay, so that's how they have it. That's fine. Man, pulling some G's there, huh? 4.256. Six. Six G's. In coupled mode. Not too shabby. I mean, I don't even mind the uh, stock paint that comes on this, but what's funny is before the rework, the 325A was a gold black and sleek. So I'm kind of disappointed that after the rework, that paint is gone. I, I mean, a girl, but I don't know if I'm a fan of the rework or not. But the 300 looks great. I don't know if I'm a fan of the rework on the 325. It just seems like it made it way more bulkier. And I miss my black paint, but I don't know. I, uh, I'm glad I tried it, but I don't know if I'm completely sold. Now, for deliveries and everything like that, they're still great, but for being an interdiction variant, I can't say that I'm all too, all too impressed by that. Do you guys use the 325 or 315 series of ships? They seem to be not that popular. Um, I kind of miss my 300, to be honest with you. I had that thing pretty dialed in. Um, so, yeah, kind of disappointed. We'll see how this goes. We'll give it a shot. I had that thing good loadout and everything. Yeah, we better slow down here. Yeah, is he gonna open up with missiles again? But of course he is. you're gonna do missiles first. One way of doing it. What do we got? A Drake, huh? Boost up to the side a little bit.
Now let's close in, let the recharge. Why is my cockpit all weird? Where's he going? You're gonna crash. What's he doing? Oh yeah, he's... Now, let's see what did I do? Oh, we're still in one piece, so that's good. What's that thing? Is that just my marker? I see. I don't know guys, um, that went better, I feel like, out of the, with a stronger bounty, we might not do that great, but, um, let's try it, actually, I mean, because this was, I felt like this went a lot better, uh, so what do we got, let's do the, MRT bounty. Let's see. Let's see how that one goes. Always found these ships to be so pretty. Alright, let's go here and try this out. Gorgeous, ain't it? It's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Right, where is this bounty at? Oh yeah, it was a different plan, it wasn't it? Let's get out of here. Let's see how we do against the MRT. I mean, it has a decent top speed also, but it's just not, I would say it's not that maneuver. Yeah, let's, we gotta get out of here. There we go. So we can get around here. There we go. Let's jump to Lyria really quick. And try the MRT bounty. I mean, the LRT was a lot easier with the smaller ships. But see, one thing we also, I, I guess we should try, is getting fixed mounts, but with bigger ships. Um, but let's see how the current setup does against the bigger target. We might have a problem with damage, or as far as DPS. But, uh, um, let's try this out and see, um, let's see how this works. Because we might not be pulling, putting out as much DPS as we potentially could with ballistics. Um, but let's give it a try and see if this would be enough against, uh, MRT bounty. Yeah, at least it's somewhere where we can quantum to, so that would make it faster. Would be nice to have our missiles. And can it be that it's actually again during the daylight? Wow, I'm getting spoiled.
Ready. Oh, yeah. Oh, looks like you are way more eager. Okay, I'll play. Okay, let's go. Good. Are we just gonna make passes here or what's man here's Holland. Let's see if I can boost this way. If I can match him somewhat. Yeah, too far. Man, okay. Jesus. Can't keep up on him. What? Where did he go? Did he crash? Where did he go? Okay. Um, guess he disappeared. Um, that was, um, that was actually a lot better. That was a lot better. I don't know. Maybe I should give this ch ship a chance. Let me make sure. Oh, yeah, we completed our bounty. Hmm. I guess uh, that worked out. Well, um, that was an MRT. Should we do an HRT? Okay, let's let's try it. Let's see uh, how close to the sun we can fly with this. And it's right here. Okay, exit the atmosphere. Yes, sir. Let's see how this goes.
Ah, uh, come on, Quantum, before I black out. Because I'm sure that's good on G's. Well, I suppose the way Quantum Drive works, G's wouldn't necessarily apply, but... Yeah, let's see if we can do an HRT on this. So far, this is the best we have done with this 325 ship ever. Without, like, struggling a bunch. So, who knows? Maybe this is worth the worth the hassle of putting gimbals on here well, let's see this is probably where we're gonna die but that's okay Let's see how 325 handles the... Okay, boys. All diamond. We'll go for him first so we can at least get paid here. No, boys. No, no, this will be tricky. We need to take this hurricane down fast. Shit. Nice. What is this? Is this, uh, Aurora? I don't know. We can probably take you out pretty easily. Yes. Okay, and what? Mustang? Is he just gonna hang around here? I'll we'll probably take him pretty good. Get a little close to the ground there. Let's get some altitude, what do you say? Let's not boost, let's get some altitude. Let him catch us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut up. Shit. And I'm gonna let this recharge here so we can actually... Well... That was, um... That's surprising... That's surprising result. I'm not gonna lie. I am, um... S325 with Gimbal's good ship? I mean, I don't know. Could we do... Surely we can. Should we do a VHRT? Surely we can't do that. Uh, okay. Um, I guess 
I guess we gotta do it. Let's see. So I guess we'll go there. Well, let's see how this will, um... <laughs> I mean, I wasn't... I didn't think we could do an HRT bounty. So, I mean, we might as well try it. We're making credits. We're making credits either way, right? Would be nice to have some missiles, but um, let's see how bad we can get a butt kick. And it's nowhere near anything we want. That's fine. Let's go fine. And let's see how we fare. This will be this will be interesting. And as previous, we're gonna leave shields where shields are. And um Let's see how it goes. This is this is pretty right here. That's pretty cool. Just skimming the cloud layer. It handles decently in Atmo too. Kind of reminds me how Saber handles, it's just Saber just feels more responsive, like the maneuvering thrusters are not working as much. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's not get crazy here. Let's get some altitude. We are so gonna die with this, but that's fine. Um, this is, this would be a worthwhile experiment. Nah, eh, should be. Oh, shit. I guess it's one way of doing it. Yeah, we got big boy. Gotta quit jousting with these folks. But I feel like we need to finish this guy off if we can. Okay. Too far, too far. Let's close in. Oh! He hurts! He hurts bad! Definitely want to stay out of that. Go. 
I'm gonna wait for full recharge this time. Okay, let's get out of here. Get some speed on them. Let's re engage. You a chunk. I don't know how we're gonna. We might not not have DPS with this guy. This guy. Holy crap! Yeah. Okay. Let's push the wave for my more of it. Yeah, let's close in. Oh shit. Oh shit. No, stay away from that. Oh, we gotta get out of here. We don't wanna be this close. Oh, we gotta go. Let's disengage. That what would you call was not fun. That was a that was a stupid move to be in front of that warden like we were. What is he doing? Oh, he gone. He's down. Um, do we just... Wait a minute, hold on. Do we just do... All those bounties, including... The VHRT bounty... In that 325... With two size twos and one size three. Um, I, I, I don't know, I don't know what to think about this. Is this good? It seems like it's good. Um, it definitely feels stuff. I mean, I know the bound, the AI can be kind of stupid but it seemed like the ship can take can take few hits there and kind of keep going um i'm impressed i'm gonna have to 
give this another shot here and maybe even upgrade components of um of the this 325 now that i see the potential but i don't i mean i'm honestly impressed i did not think we would be able to do what we did what i what i think i like about the 325 and decoupled mode the thrusters are pretty powerful where i can the acceleration is really good where i can strafe whichever way i want without a delay i really like that i will um i will admit when i'm wrong and i guess we'll uh we'll experiment with this because i definitely think this warrants further investi investigation i mean my my stuff didn't really get that messed up it's definitely a pleasant surprise i did not think after doing the stock loadout and upgrading the stock loadout for still different weapons but not gimbal to getting gimbals and then downgrading it to two size two repeaters and one size three i definitely did not think it was gonna be this good but can't i guess can't argue with results right i mean can't can't argue with how it performed and even when the shields were down it didn't automatic i mean it seemed like the i'm gonna have to look it up but he was like the whole hull had a decent hp um yeah i'm i'm pretty impressed have you do any of you guys have the 300 series like either 315 or 325 did you guys fly what have been your experiences as far as doing the bounties and stuff like that i mean because now let's say if i use the ship for delivery missions i know i can kind of hold my own against an npc not the player because i am pretty crappy at dogfighting as you can see but why is my hud all screwed up but against an npc i mean i don't think we were able to do the hrt bounty this thing is flying all wacky. What are you doing? Calm down. Calm down. Um, but I am I am pleasantly surprised. No no complaints here. Hey, when it gets jerky like that, stop it. I don't know if it's this, this, this thruster. There we go. It just seems that there we go. Well, that wasn't too bad. Okay, here. And of course, no service required. Well, I know for a fact that the service is required. And yet, I guess I can't get fuel, can't get anything. Oh, perfect. And you know, what I should stop doing is I should stop going to Area 18 and all that. I should just go to the space station and not waste time with getting out of HAPS, go, you know, taking the tram and all that stuff. I should just make my home on a space station and call it a day. That way, it'll be a lot quicker to go back and forth. Okay, so we got a little banged up. I mean, we took some hits. Yeah, being in front of that uh, warden was not smart. I'm like, what am I thinking? I mean, we got a little banged up, but it kind of gives a character. And keep in mind, we did that, all this with no missiles. Pretty impressive. All right, guys, let me know what you think. Um, 
maybe a keeper? More like a luxurious cargo slash light PVE ship? I'm definitely gonna keep this load out and maybe look for better components for it. So we will see. Take care and see you in the next one.